One of the biggest fears that my students who are training to become a thought leader have is dealing with critics. This is what I say to people. If you're putting out content and you're finding that you're being criticized by people, well, first of all, understand that's part of the journey. But that doesn't mean that you have to put up with it. There is a difference between somebody who asks the question to understand something versus somebody who asks the question to undermine you personally. Now, if somebody is asking a question to understand something and they're opposing your perspective and it appears to be critical in nature, I suggest that you respond and you make them see your perspective. And certainly I would expect that if you're putting out content, you're well researched enough to be able to support your point of view. However, if you find that somebody is putting comments on your post with the intent of undermining you personally, and you know that it's a personal attack, then I really strongly believe that thought leaders, experts and content creators have almost a moral responsibility to put people back in their place. Now, I don't say this with any aggression. The reason I say this very simply is because if somebody doesn't deter them from attacking people personally, they're going to continue to do that. In the world of social media, anyone is free to share their thoughts and opinions. Nobody deserves to be personally attacked for doing so. And I feel that as long as people get, keep getting away with it, these critics and these haters keep getting away with it, what they're going to do is they're going to continue to go from one person to another and they're going to undermine and, and discourage everyone else's confidence. You know, it's been said that all it takes for evil to flourish is for good people to do nothing. Being good doesn't mean that you sit there quietly and you allow this to happen. Sometimes we have to take a stance. You know, if it's my forum and you have come in and you've disrespected me and you are trying to say something that is a personal attack, please understand I will respond and I'm going to speak to you in the same language that you've spoken to me in. It's not a case for an eye for eye. That's not what I believe in. However, I believe that it's important for me to ensure that you don't do that type of thing because I'm strong enough to withstand it. But I know that there's a lot of people who are going to be deterred if you go and personally attack them when they simply all they're trying to do is share their information and insights. So in summary, if you're somebody that's putting out content and you know that somebody is attacking you personally, don't stay quiet. Make sure that you are putting something out there to deter them from doing that because if you don't, they're going to continue to do it to others.